Capone Tone here and welcome to part 3 of my Chrono Trigger walkthrough. We now have Morrow back in our party, or I should say uh, Princess Nadia. So now we need to get back to our original time, since we're still in the past. And yep, you can get a shelter from that monster every time you enter the forest. But now we finally have a three person party, the max you can have in this game. And we're gonna fuck these monsters up. Thing is, Marl and Luca are mainly more magic oriented. Their attacks are pretty weak. So once you learn some better techniques with them, they will be uh, much more of an asset to the party. Alright, now we just need to actually, yeah, never mind. I was looking for something that is not there yet, so just ignore that. Head back to Truce Canyon, and uh, we're just going to go back to where we came from. How we ended up here in this time era, time period, whatever. But we got another battle. These poly guys are stronger than their green counterparts. They counterattack every time you attack, so they can do some damage. They have about 100 HP, I believe. Bastard! Kill him! Alright. And these green imps, you know they suck. <laughs> Chrono level up, Luca level up. Nice. Now we're going to equip... Uh, something better than the Ribbon. We'll go with the Defender. Ribbon stinks. But here we go! The, fam the famous Luca music. So badass. It just screams victory. <laughs> and then you can see that gate right there. And now Luca created a gate key, which keeps these gates stable. And will bring us back to our original time period. You're a genius, Luca. And she's kind of explaining what I just explained. <laughs> Gate key! Why did this gate suddenly appear? I don't know. It's all so confusing. But screw it. Time to go back. Whoa! And we're back! At the Millennial Fair! 1000 AD. And yep, that's where this, or when this game takes place, is 1000 AD. And Luca's gonna go do some work, and we have to take Marl back to her castle. We will escort her home. Alright, to get her home, obviously, just take the same path that we took to get to the castle. First, we're going to head into the market, see what they have over here. What can I do for you? Um, hmm. Bronze mill could help. We already have a maiden suit. And load up on some tonics. Just because they're extremely cheap. I'd advise to buy some heals too, just to cure some status ailments. Now we're back in the Guardia Forest. That tab isn't there. <laughs> that number that uh power tab that I left sitting there in the 600 AD. It's not here. I thought it would um, leaving it there would make it appear in both time periods, but apparently not. 
So once I go back to 600 AD, I'll just pick up the power tab. But we have a quick battle and some beetles and this bird that has a horn in its mouth or bell, whatever. Abigan Chaos just got his butt whooped. Ah. Alright. Bypass most enemies. And now we're gonna head into Guardia Castle 1000 AD. Princess Nadia, where have you been? Were you abducted? We had soldiers searching for you. Scoundrel, you're the one who kidnapped Princess Nadia. You confused her and tried to take over the throne, terrorist! So, what the hell? It's like a freaking ambush. What are you doing? <laughs> Detain him! This is bullshit. Didn't do a damn thing. You remember on the last video where his uh, ancestor, Chancellor Ancestor, said that we need the justice system that will prevent anything from happening again, kidnappings and stuff, so that's why this guy's uh, pretty harsh. Just assume Chrono is a terrorist. <laughs> so now we're in court to see if Chrono's guilty of abducting Princess Nadia. I'll just call him Marl for the rest of the game. Let us begin. Ordered to tell the truth. Premeditated abduction of royalty. That is some offense. No abduction did take place. So our lawyer is trying to defend us. Make sure no bullshit happens. And follow my guidelines, say I did. Because we actually did initiate the contact. We ran into Marl when we first met her. So, yeah, we're just telling the truth. That's not really criminal abduction. She followed us. <laughs> it's not like we brought her against her will. So, what a prick. Objection! Chrono's character is at the very core of this case. We have nothing to hide. And we have a witness. Remember this? A little girl will vouch for Chrono. Character of Chrono. Remember at the Millennial Fair, we saved the. We found the cat for that little girl? Yep. Brought her the kitty. So kind. <laughs> Looks like they're buying it. Damn right. We don't have a motive to uh, kidnap Princess Nadia. What about Ransom? Fortune did not tempt me. Not at all. Get off my ass. Defense rests. So now, if you followed all my guidelines in my first video about what I did in the fair and stuff, you will get every single person to say not guilty. As you will see. For some reason, everyone in the jury is a twin. Looks exactly alike. <laughs> Old guy with orange hair. <laughs> Wearing a green vest. Yeah, it's pretty weird. Look at that. 
All these not guilties. Look like a freaking dumbass chancellor. But despite this, the outcome will always be the same. Verdict has been reached. Verdict is not guilty. Fact remains. Did not kim did not kidnap her, but he ran off with her. Three days of solitary confinement as punishment. That's still bullshit. She ran off with me. That's enough, my dear. Behave like a princess. You must obey the rules. Leave the rest up to the Chancellor. Even though he's a freaking idiot. We're leaving. Chrono! So, they still took us away despite being not guilty of anything. Which is just complete horse crap. But, what can you do? It's a flawed justice system we got here. Harris tried to overthrow the kingdom. Must carry out his sentence. Not guilty though. What sentence? Did not kidnap her. Execution in three days? What the fuck? So I just. I was not guilty of anything, but they're still gonna kill me. I mean, what the fuck? <laughs> Freaking asshole. Now they're gonna lock us up and apparently kill us in three days. And that will be the end of Chrono Trigger. Nah, I'm just kidding. But this will be the end of part three of my Chrono Trigger walkthrough. And if you like our videos, follow us at Facebook at facebook.com slash awkwardponers or at Twitter at twitter.com slash awkwardponers.